I'm so happy to have all of you here to celebrate with me. All 700 of you guys. <laughs> um, I cannot believe it is Christmas Day. It went by so quickly. I will not be on today, and this is a scheduled upload, so I'm not actually, like, in Star Stable recording this or anything, but I just wanted to wish you all a very Merry Christmas. I hope you are staying healthy and happy. Having a splendid Christmas today. Now, I'm not actually on, and I did not record this on Christmas. However, I felt like I had to post something to celebrate this special day. So, I decided to do a video where I'm going to be doing my predictions for 2020 run regarding the club, the channel, and Star Stable. And we'll see how well they come true or not. And then next year, I'm going to do more predictions and see if my predictions came true. So, yay! Future stuff! We. Alright, first off, we have to do predictions for Star Stable because I have quite a few. First off, I really predict that they're going to update a lot more horses next year. Um, I think they're going to have another situation like the Frisians where someone's not going to like them or multiple people are not going to like them, but they turn out good. I don't know why, I just feel like they're going to have that situation again. Um, I think that we're going to get a lot of epic story quests next year. At least that's what I hope. They're working very hard to make story quests, so that's why I'm not really complaining if they do or not. Plus, I haven't actually saved Anne yet, so, <laughs> you know. Um, another prediction I have for Star Stable would be that I think that they're going to have some new, like, um, menus and, like, hubs, things like, like this. You know, I think they're going to change it up a little bit. At least I hope, because they have these that are super updated, but then everything else isn't that updated. So it would be nice if they updated the HUD a little bit just to make it look a little bit better or fresher. And same with the club thing, hopefully. I hope they come out with a whole new list here because that would just look so good um i uh predict that they're going to come out some with some really good horses next year i have a feeling they're going to release a bunch of magic horses again but they're going to release some really good new horses next year that people have been wanting for a long time i don't know exactly what but i have a feeling they're going to release some really good realistic horses very soon i also think they're going to be adding some really cute pets. I'm hoping for a peacock pet for some reason. I know they're updating the rabbits and I just want a lot of pets and I think they're going to release quite a few pets next year. I think for their birthday next year they're going to do some very different colors from what we've seen before. Like a completely new palette like blue and red or something. Something completely different than anything they've done before with it. I also think that Star Stable is going to have a huge burst of popularity especially since they're working on new games and things i think that's going to happen i also think that they're going to get voice more voice acting stuff like the um soul rider stories at least that's what i'm really pulling for because i still don't know their voice actors and i would love to know if anyone can give me a source to their voice actors that would be great um, but yeah, I, I'm very excited for Star Stable's future. I'm hoping they're going to update a bunch of old models, like Justin. That would be amazing if they updated them, and like Jasper and stuff. I also think they're going to finish up updating um, current areas of the game and start working on brand new ones, like Wild Woods. I'm very excited for that moment when that ever happens. I don't think they're going to come out with a full new area, but something more like Starshine or Wild Woods. Where it's not completely new, but it is new er, you know. Very hopeful. But we're gonna go into it. I think we're definitely going to have at least 900 subscribers next year. I don't think we're gonna get to a thousand. If we do, that would be incredible. I think we're gonna get it to at least 800 or 900 though. And I think we might be on our way to a thousand by this time next year. And maybe we're even farther or closer. I have no idea. I guess that's up to future Anna to decide. Um, I think I'm going to get even better at editing just because I've definitely improved just from these last months. If you look at the Pink Rabbits Award Show, that was amazing editing in my opinion. But I got even better at it. And I'm thinking my channel's going to have some better editing. I don't think a lot of uh, famous YouTubers are gonna notice me at all. They haven't, I mean, there's been a few, but none that have been like 
everyone knows of. So I don't need that because Abigail Pinehaven noticed me and she is my favorite Sir Stable YouTuber, so that's all I need. That or Chiara Moonstone, that would be amazing, but I doubt that's going to happen, so that's not a prediction. Um, I think that the Pink Rabbits Club channel is going to have a lot of new viewers, a lot of old ones are going to start fading out, sadly, but I think that's just all part of it. I think some old viewers might come back to comment or something. I think we're going to get some pretty good chances of popularity, at least within, like, the rabbit circle. I also think that, um, or at least I'm hoping that we're going to have an official club website very soon, um, which might actually be happening very soon. Um, and I think uh, Miss Sinclair is even going to get more subscribers and a website as well, which is very exciting. Um, but yeah, I, I think those are my main predictions. I think that next year I will have a, hopefully, community tab or like a good idea of what I'm going to do with my channel. I'm hoping that my new channel, Lovely Pink Buddy, is going to get more popular just because that channel is going to be kind of my transition into getting out of Star Stable. Not getting out of it, but you know what I mean, like transitioning from Star Stable. Um, but yeah, I'm, those are what I'm thinking is going to happen next year. Now, this year I uh, questioned the club a lot. Like, I thought of temporarily disbanding the club to get some new more like new members or something I don't know I I was thinking of that for a little while because of drama and stuff but I decided not to and just kept going on and I'm glad I did because then I would have to get a bunch of members back um but I think next year uh is gonna be a pretty decent year for rabbits I think it's gonna be pretty similar to this year I think there's gonna be less drama next year at least I hope I mean there wasn't a lot of drama this year just a little bit but, um, I'm hoping that we're still going strong next year. I think we're gonna have a lot of close members next year. I think members like, um, Lighty and Eve and stuff are going to become, like, club leaders or owners by next year, hopefully. I think some of the more, like, older members are gonna start leaving after, you know, so long. I don't want y'all to leave, by the way, but that's what I just think is going to happen. At least some of the older members are going to start fading out and going different places, which honestly, I don't mind. As sad as it is, I've learned that it's just better to let them go than keep them here. Um, but overall, I think it's going to be a pretty good year. I think we're going to get some new rabbits, but for the most part, just stay similarly to now. I don't think we're going to be doing many events either, just because I'm not very good at hosting events. And yeah, so overall, I think that 2021 is going to be a pretty good year, um, at least Star Stable and channel-wise. I hope it is. I hope you guys can be along with me on this journey. I hope you guys can make these predictions come true to Star Stable, to my rabbits, to my subscribers. I hope all of you guys are doing better than ever, and I know this has been a really weird year, and hopefully next year is going to be way better. And I hope you guys have a Merry Christmas. Bye, rabbits out! <laughs>